It was a nightmare. I couldn't sleep at night. I went to sleep, but my ears are still on thinking about what can I do for my children, because I've gone through so many violence. And even my husband nearly killed me too. So I feel that there's something wrong. I have to do something. That's the time that I came out and I got into this women organization. When this funding come, it helps us to prevent all this violence. Now the situation is going down. Not much cases are reported now. But before we didn't get this funding from Oxfam, it was a bushfire. So many women were killed. We have four people in eight districts. So these are the people who call us, who text us, telling us that this location has this, this issue. We empower the women. We give them advice. We explain. If you don't go to the court and bring your husband to the court, he will face all this problem again. When their cases are at high risk, uh, we keep them in the safe house. Some survivors, they came and live in the safe house for a year too. I've seen so many good things happen. Some changes have come over some years now. We've seen that and now women and men in the community, they already know what is their roles and responsibilities. I want to see more women come out like me and stand and talk about others, women and children who are affected like us. And they can be happy 